Hey guys, so today we're gonna be making this amazing, famous Popeye spicy chicken sandwich. I'm gonna show you how you can make it on your own at home. So stay tuned. All right, so I do have three chicken breasts. They're nice washed and cleaned. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take my cutting board. And I'm just gonna go ahead and flatten out my chicken. I don't want it to be too thick because I do want it to fry all the way. So I'm just gonna go ahead and smash it down. I'm gonna go ahead and start seasoning my chicken now that I've finished flattening it. So I have some hot Hungarian paprika. I have some, I believe, onion powder. I always mix the two garlic powder. White pepper. Slap your mama, Cajun season. And I'm just gonna go ahead and add some salt. Go ahead and just mix that all together. So now, go ahead and add the buttermilk. Let's go ahead and add So that will be a cup. All right guys, now we're gonna go ahead and make the flour for the chicken. So I have one cup of flour. I also have some cornstarch. So the cornstarch is gonna make your chicken nice and crispy. You do want that crispy, nice edge. And then we do have some garlic powder some onion powder. So pretty much we're just repeating some hot Hungarian paprika. This does the trick. And we also have, again, slap your mama, Cajun seasoning. And I'm just gonna go ahead and add some salt. So go ahead and just Mix it all together. And I would recommend that you do go ahead and taste your flour, just a tad bit, so you know if you have all the salt that you need, okay? Guys, now I'm gonna go ahead and crack some eggs. We're gonna make the coating for the chicken. So I have two eggs. I also have half a cup of buttermilk. And I'm also gonna add some hot sauce. And we're gonna mix that all together. All right guys, so my chicken has been marinating in the fridge for about two hours. So now we're gonna go ahead and uncover it. So we're gonna go ahead and start coating our chicken. Mmm, it smells so good, guys. We're gonna dip it in the flour. Just go ahead and shake off the excess milk. Dip it in the flour. Then shake off the flour. Dip it in the egg mixture both sides. And then we're gonna go back and dip it in the flour again. So make sure that you are wearing gloves because it's get a little nasty. And you wanna press the flour into the chicken. So this is how our chicken looks, all coated. I'm gonna go ahead and set it to the side for about five minutes and then we're gonna go ahead and start frying. If our oil is hot enough, by putting it in a wooden spoon, if you see the bubbles, that means 
the oil is nice and hot. If you have a thermometer, you can also check to see if it's at 350. So now we're gonna go ahead and start adding in our chicken. So carefully add your chicken. And we're gonna cook the chicken until it's nice golden and brown. It should take about possibly 10 to 16 minutes, okay? All right, we're just gonna go ahead and check on the chicken. And it's nice and golden brown. And this is exactly how your chicken should look. Let's take a closer look. Just look at that, guys. And I'm just gonna go ahead and set it on the rack so it can drain out the oil, okay? Let's take a look at the chicken. It's nice and golden brown. The breading helped a lot getting that thickness. Nice and crunchy. So we're setting it on the rack so we can go ahead and drain out all that oil. I'm gonna go ahead and make a spicy mayo. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add some mayo to my bowl. I'm gonna add some Kanye pepper. And we're just gonna mix this all together. I'm also heating up my stove because I'm gonna go ahead and toast our buns or our chicken sandwiches. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and start getting our buns ready so we can go ahead and toast them. All right, I'm just gonna take some butter, just lightly coat it with butter. You don't need a lot. All right, so I'm gonna use my cast iron skillet to toast these buns. So we're gonna get a nice, toasty, buttery bread. So this is how our bread looks. It's nice and toasty. Now we're just gonna set this to the side. So now we're gonna go ahead and start building the sandwich, the moment we've all been waiting for. So I have my mayo right here. I'm gonna go ahead and add that mayo to our nice toasty bread. I have some nice sweet pickles. Chicken. And we're just going to put a little more mayo on this side. And there goes our sandwich, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and also stay tuned for more recipes.